Today, we're going to make the heating in my house smart. I've got the latest from Google. It's the Google Nest thermostat. This uh, claims to be able to save me money on my energy bill, and I'm all about that. On heating, 10 to 12% a year alone, and on cooling, up to 14%. And it does this by using smart controls and scheduling. In the Google Home app, once you've got this set up, you tell it things like when you go to bed, when you're gonna go away. Also, you can have it geolocate your, your cell phone as well. So when you leave your house, it knows to turn the temperature down to save the uh, energy and uh, the money. You do have to know what type of heating system you do have. It typically works with most low voltage systems that are out there. You can go up to the Google website and they've got this great chart on all the different type of systems that it does work with and a compatibility checker as well. So again, it works on low voltage systems. It does not work on high voltage systems. So if you're in an apartment or townhome that uses electric baseboard heating, this isn't the one for you. So the first step is we've taken the old thermostat off the wall and we're gonna check the wires and using the Google compatibility checker here with the wires, we can tell exactly if it's compatible or not. Okay, so let's check the wiring out. I've got the compatibility checker here and I love it because it's so simple. So hit the buttons and go along here. First things first, take the old thing off. We did and continue. Now it's gonna ask about the wiring. Do I see any of this type of wiring on it? No, you can hit continue. And this, I love this. It actually asks me what type of wires that I have on here. And hopefully on your old thermostat, they've labeled them all properly, but I can see I've got an RC. So I'm gonna hit the RC button. I've got a C and I have a W1. I'm not an electrician. I don't know what any of that really means. So this is a really handy tool. So I hit the yes, continue. Poof, we are compatible. Google also has two other thermostats in their line. They've got the Google Nest Learning Thermostat and the Google Nest E. The Google Nest E is the most like the one that we're looking at now, but it does have the additional capability of adding sensors that you can purchase for it to give you even more control of the temperature in your room. The Google Nest Learning Thermostat takes it to another level, has the capability to add additional sensors. It also includes a trim plate and it's got the full color screen on it as well. So again, if you are not comfortable with electricity or setting these things up, go to Home Depot, get them to help find a certified electrician for you. Uh, again, you need to follow the instructions implicitly. Now that I've got it set up, I've got a smart thermostat, I've got the schedule going, and hopefully I'll start saving some money.